Hello my my beauty queens, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm excited to bring to you, I purchased two five pan palettes by Pat McGrath. And the first one is called Lunar Nightshade. How beautiful is this? This is the box that it came in. And this is the um, packaging. This reminds me of her release last year. And these are the colors right here. And then I also purchased this one right here and this one is called bordeaux bliss it was easier well not easier but it was better to get two so this is bordeaux bliss right here it was better to get two because when you bought two you got um ten dollars off and then with her extra ten percent so i only pay like 50 bucks for these and then um shipping so you can't beat that so yeah, let's get into it. So we're gonna, um, so today we're gonna just focus on, I'm sorry for that loud noise, but today we're gonna just focus on the Lunar Nightshades. And once again, that's what they are. I'm gonna swatch them after we're done. And these are the shades right here. So first off, I'm gonna take my Kosas Concealer. Bam. Almost like some car just spinning around or doing something, I don't know. Take my Kosas Concealer. And put this on the lids, give it something to stick to. Not on camera, so I'm gonna um, put a little bit. Put this on here to make it stick. Now let me know if you picked up anything from the Pat McGrath Bijou collection. I said I wasn't going to pick up nothing, but I didn't have none of her five pants, so I was like, okay, I'll just get two of those. All right, so this is the concealer blended out. All right, so now I'm going to take, what color are we going to take first? So first we're going to take this burgundy color right here, and we're going to put that in the crease. We're going to take that, and I'm just going to take my taper blending brush by Morgan Sigma. And I'm just digging there. Did I put my, I mean, it is a little kick up in the pan. This is my first time using it, so I'm just going to stamp it to get that color payoff. Then I'm going to blend it. So yeah, let me know if you picked up anything from Pat McGrath. I want to know from her collections. They haven't been, some kind of her collections been a little bit underwhelming, but. So I've been saving a little coin or two. So this is what we're looking like. You see it's deep skin friendly. You see it is pigmented. You guys, I'm sorry about that noise. I don't know what the heck they doing out there. So yeah, let me know what you think. If you did pick up these um, qu um, quaints or five pans and what you think about them. I didn't have no five pans, so I was excited to um, get them. And I'm just doing this because I want to build it up for the camera. So you guys will be able to see it because I can see it, but I just want to make sure I build it up for the camera. So that's what we're looking like right there. So I'm going to do the other side. And stamp it first. Pick up that color. Now we're going to just blend. And I blend and do circular motions. So the shadows is blending nicely. I'm not having no problems with them blending. So far, so good. Yeah, I talked all that mess in. I wasn't going to get nothing but... I didn't get no blushes because most of the blushes that she had in them palettes I already had. And then the ones I didn't have wasn't deep skin friendly enough to me. And all them colors, I already have them. You know, when she um, released her other holiday palettes, the big mega palettes. I wish she would have released something like that, but maybe I would have purchased it. All right, so this is real time blending, y'all. So that's what we're looking like right now. These are very nice, very pigmented. So now I'm going to take this um this shade right here i'm gonna take this shade and we're gonna just put that on my brow bone and for that i'm just picking brushes up um i just got a brushes in front of me <laughs> so for that what i'm gonna use for that i'm gonna use my mac 224s brush that's what this one look like it looks similar to this um sigma brush but it's a little more tapered as you can see so i'm gonna take that um deep color right here and i'm gonna just put that on the outer corner and we might put that on the lash line too we're gonna see so see what this color looking like. See how it pick up. Okay. It's picking up. I'm just stamping the color first. Alright, that's pretty. I like this. I'm stamping it. 
I ain't gonna put no more product on the brush now. We're just gonna blend that in. So yeah, let your girl know. Okay, I wanna wipe some of this product off. I've tapped it a little bit too much. So let me just get this because I don't want it to be super, super dark. So I just wipe my brush off, wipe some of the product off. And I'm gonna just blend this in. So that's what we're looking like right here. And then I'm gonna take um, this color right here and we're gonna put that on our lid. I'm gonna use my finger for that. They feel nice and creamy, that's what it looks like. So yeah, the colors are nice. They feel soft. Let your girl know what you think. If you pick this up, I think this is one of the most different from Pat McGrath. So I wanted to really get this one. And then, like I said, because you could get two for $10 off and then 10% off, I went on and got two. And so that's what we're looking like right there. How pretty is that? All right, so now I'm going to take this brush right here because I lost some of the burgundy with that deep shade. Let me just go back in there with that burgundy and put some at the top of that dark shade. Bring some of that burgundy back in there. Okay, there we go. Yeah, this is pretty. Let me know what you think. All right, so that's what we're looking like right there. I'm just gonna take um, a brush and do my inner corner. And with that one, I'm going for my inner corner. I'm going to take this shade right here for my inner corner. No, I'm going to take this shade right here for my inner corner. I'm not really getting no fallout yet. And brighten it up a little bit. So this is what we're looking like. How pretty is this? All right, so that's what we're looking like right there. And now I'm going to take my brush right here. I'm going to wipe it off. And then I'm going to put a lighter color under my brow bone. And then we're going to do a different look on this side. Not so dark look. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to take um, this shade right here. And we're going to just put this on my brow bone. I got the um, film on there. Nice and little product off. So these are pigmented. And then blend some of that darkness in. With my light color. So yeah, let your girl know what you think. I think this one came out very cute. Very deep. It's called, what is it called? It is called the Lunar Nightshade. So yeah, this is very pretty. Let your girl know what you think. And then too, I will take some... Um, Take this little brush right here and take this shade right here and put it um, on my waterline and uh, and let's see what that look like so i'm taking this brush right here and we're going to just put that on my waterline so that's what that looks like right there then i'm gonna wipe it off and then i'm gonna take the lighter shade and put it in my waterline or the inner yeah, in a lot of water line. So that's what we're looking like right there. How pretty is this? I think this is really pretty. Take this again. So like I said, this is the first look, and then I do need to do a little more blending right here because I went a little crazy. So I'm gonna just wipe off my brush and then I just wanna blend this in. So let me know what you think of the look. I got it all on my nose. I'll fix that, you guys, but yeah, just let me know what you think of the look. Very pretty. I think this palette is very nice. Yeah. All right. So we're going to move right ahead. So I already got the um, burgundy in this corner. So we're going to go a little lighter on this eye. I'm not going to go so deep. So on this eye, we're going to put um, this shade right here. I'm going to use my finger. This is what the color look like. Well, I didn't even know that was like a pink. That's pretty. We're going to do this color right here.
go back in with this brush right here put in the burgundy just to outline that How pretty is that? I did not know that was um pink like that. Like that little shift. Trying to get it all over the red. Yeah, this is very pretty. Look at this. Go back in with some of that burgundy. Light my brush off. Put some of that lighter color in the um and up in the outer. Okay, I'm gonna brow bone. Yeah, how pretty is this? Let me blend that out a little bit. This seems like when I wanna film, everybody wanna rev up bodies, do donuts in the street, guys. I don't know. That's what we're looking like right here. How pretty is that? So we got the nighttime look, and then we got the pretty daytime look. And if you want, you can leave this off if you want and just use like a lighter concealer for matte. But for the sake of this um, palette, I'm trying to use them all. Okay. Now I'm going to take this little brush right here. We're going to go in with this deeper shade. And we're going to just put this like a little wing. Just like that. Can you see? Uh, I'm trying to still keep it daytime, so I don't want to do too much of a wing I'm trying to do a daytime wing I'm gonna pull it out a little more so you can see it on the camera all right you can see it now yeah I'm trying to keep this daytime appropriate so we can have night and day so that's what we're looking like right there with the little wing how cute is that and then what else I'm gonna take I'm gonna take let me just amp it up a little bit, but you see how this is right here. Very cute. Yeah, that's very cute. So now I'm going to take this color right here. I said I'm going to make it daytime, but I just can't help putting something in my inner corner, you guys. I can't help it. <laughs> I'm going to take this green shade right here and put it in my inner corner. Just a little. All right, so let me know what you think of this palette. I think this is the most different and very palette that Pat McGrath has um, as far as her colors. So let me know what you think. Okay, so yeah, now I'm going to take this and put some of this lighter um, color on my lid. So I'm going to take some of this lighter color right here. So I took this color right here. I'm going to take some of that lighter color and I'm going to put that on my waterline. Because I don't want to be too dark, so... So yeah, let me know what you think. So yeah, I'll just put some of that on the waterline. That like opened my eye. So let your girl know. So this is one look with the um, Lunar Nightshade palette. And this is another look. So let your girl know what you think about this palette. And then too, you could just use one shade all over the lid or however you want to use it is all up to you. But I think this palette is very pretty. Let your girl know what you think. Now I'm going to swatch these shades for you. So you can see what they look like. Oh, no I'm not. First, well yeah, I'll swatch the shade. No, I'm going to do my mascara first. And then I'll be back. And then we'll have the swatches. So yeah, this is very pretty. Let me know what you think. These, um, This mascara is very, very nice. This is the Huda Beauty One Coat. One Coat. One Coat. Um, So yeah, let your girl know if you tried this. This is very nice. So yeah, let your girl know. Okay, that looked a little better. Because I went too far in right here. That looked a little crazy. Okay, that's better. All right, let me know what you think. This is the Pat McGrath Bishu. Hope I'm saying it right. Bishu Lunar Nightshade Palette. Okay, now I'm going to swatch the shades for you so you can see them.
So here go the colors right here. Let your girl know. So I got my nighttime holiday look going on, whatever you want to call it. But I got the nighttime look. I think this is very, very pretty. And then I got like a daytime, a little amped up daytime. Or you can order this at nighttime if you want. But let your girl know, let your girl know, let your girl know. These are the five shades. This is the Lunar New Year. Well, I say Lunar New Year. This is the Lunar Nightshade. I'm just making up names. So Lunar Nightshade. Let your girl know what you think. Yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, tap that notification bell. Check out my YouTube community tab and all my other social sites. Stay safe. Stay well. Kisses. Peace out.